Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Sword. This time, we're going in the middle of where Chairman Rose at Hammerlock Stadium. That's not a correct sentence. We're going to meet Chairman Rose at Hammerlock Stadium, and if you've noticed, I've changed my appearance for probably the third time in this series. Um, I gave myself soulless eyes because that's what I am right now. Anyway, let's get on with the video. <laughs> um, let's just head in and see what's about to happen. And I just realized they have a drawbridge. Would they ever cover? Would they ever pull that back up for any reason? Drawbridge. Hemlock Stadium doubles as an energy plant. That's epic. Now, have a look at my tablet. I've got all the information you need on it. I got a tablet, bro. Bro, look at him go. See, an easy to understand description of the energy plant. Easy to understand if I could only read this language. First energy is absorbed from the Hammerlock Stadium's tower, then is changed to electricity at the underground power plant to deliver it to people throughout the region. Well, that's uh, pretty eco-friendly, I think it was. I don't even know the word. Our lives in society requires various types of energy sources, such as electricity, natural gas, and water. My associate, my associate groups aim to improve everyone's lives by harnessing the power stored in Wishing Stars. Oh, it's time for me to get to work. I should get a move on before Alina decides to give me another earful. Ha! <laughs> Got him. Since I suggest you head over to the vault next. Just head toward Route 6 from the stadium and you should find the vault without any issues. So, like, is this like a Pokemon? Okay, this is a Pokemon. And this is... Uniform Shop. Oh, yeah, these things. I have no money, so I am i can't do this. All these uniforms look really weird. <laughs> yeah, I'm done shopping for now. I, I'm about to head out. I'll see you all when I get to the vault. We found Leon. Since, seems you're doing well collecting gym badges. But ha, huh, did something happen with him? He was really- Oh my god, he was acting really odd when I ran into him. Mm, I'm sorry, Leon. He took one look at me and immediately said, and was immediately like, it would mean like, I'm so sorry, Lee. It might be the first time I've heard him apologize for anything, and I have no idea what it was for. Wait, is that was that an insult? Like, the first time I've ever heard him apologize for anything, or did he just ha has he just not, not done anything really bad? Maybe he's feeling down because he had some hard losses in a battle? He lost that challenge with you. When you lose, you feel down in the dumps. But, when the, but then there's nowhere left to go but back up. You gotta think on why it was you lost, though. You know, that little brother of mine, I think he might yet become a surprisingly great trainer. Blast, and look at the time. I nearly forgot my meeting with the chairman. That only really, really lets me hear it when I'm late. Now, if only I can remember which way to go. Anyway, I said you go say hello to Rahan while you're here soon. He's the greatest rival I've got in the final hurdle that you'll have to face in the gym challenge. He should still be around the vault if you hurry. It's down that way onto Route 6. Wait, no, Leon, that's the wrong way! <laughs> God damn it. We've made it to the vault. Oh, if it isn't the trainer endorsed by the champion. Let's see, what was your name again? <laughs> what? <laughs> ah, right, Synth. I don't know why I have to look at your phone for that, but... If Leon rec himself recognizes your potential, then I guess you'll grow into quite the trainer. At the same time, though, anyone wanting to challenge the mighty Rahan has to prove they're up to it by earning seven gym badges first. I already knew that. Ah, so you're here to see our treasures, are you? Gaining a better understanding of Pokemon by studying history certainly isn't a bad idea. I like your spirit, kid. Follow me, why don't you? Alright. I'll even spare you one of my lead cards. Epic game. We're gonna take a look at that after this cutscene. Or whenever you get the chance, I guess. You put the lead card in your album. Now on you go. If it's the vault you want, it's up those stairs there. Let's, let's, uh, let's check out this lead card first. Though. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> what? Look at his face. Dude, 
Auto style will use like weather effects. Oh jeez, if I have to deal with weather effects that late into the game, I'd rather jump off a bridge. I'm kidding. <laughs> Why was he screaming though? I'm so confused. That looks so weird. Where are we at? You gotta check the secret, bruh. I didn't need that, but secrets, bruh. Partially low if he attacks that. Okay, maybe I need that. I'm probably never gonna use it though. It's Sonia. Oh, you're here. Really, it aren't they? <laughs> it's the great. It's it's the great. It's great that there's still treasured tapestries that can tell us of Galar's history. The two youths watching a wishing star. A disaster occurs. The two bewildered youths. <laughs> the youths looking on at the sword and shield that's stopping the disaster. And the youths be being crowned. These tapes speaks tell the story of a, cer of a of certain cre of creation of the kingdom in Galar. Say, young gym challenger, what sticks out to you most about them? What sticks out to you most about them? There's two heroes, the darkest day. I want to say the fact that there's two heroes, because, like, a kingdom can only have one king, right? But they've both been crowned, unless one of them is a female. And then be king and queen, but still. Bang on, the statue at that hotel in Lotus Oak only had one hero. No matter how you slice it, wait a second, she's right! I didn't even think about that! But here, we clearly have two youths. Was there really only one hero, or are there two? And what even caused the darkest day? Thanks for letting me bounce some ideas off you. I think I've got some theories now. I'm going to research the tapestries a tad more. But you have your gym challenge, right? I'm cheering for you, so take a couple of these. I hope some more of your wins. Yo, bro, thanks for the free revive. Revive? I, I meant revives. So now it's time for us to head out. So I guess I'll see you guys when I get back onto the route. Never mind. The tapestries in the vault depict the heroes of the Galar's region's past. I suppose if we got any modern hero, it would have to be our champion, Leon. Listen up, Synth. Your goal is to defeat that superstar Leon, so go conquer Route 6 and train yourself up along the way to Stowan's side. To Stowan's side? Is that the name of the town and you just can't pronounce it, or...? Um... Alright, I guess I'll see you all when I head to Stowan's side next. I'll see you all when I conquer Route 6, like Rahan told me to. Never mind, I keep getting interrupted before I cut stuff out. <laughs> what a cute, silly cobra. Just look at those adorable eyes. It's our duty as Team Yon to make sure silly cobra gets a nice, peaceful sleep. Then don't. If I promise not to wake up Pokemon, will you let me through? Of course, it'd be our pleasure. I. So what about me, though? Can I, can I get back? Oh, hey, Synth, you're heading to Stowan's side, right? Boy, Team Yell, don't suppose you'll let us through? Nah, you kids are way too loud. Can't be- You're screaming right now. Are you serious? And we're practically not fond of kids wearing a challenge band. With all your stomping around, Silly Comb is sure to wake up. You're the one stomp- Oh, I hate how retarded they are. Right. What do you say, Synth? If you don't get past them, we'll be able to continue our gym challenges at the Stowan's side. I'll battle him. Yeah, you. Yeah, that's the spirit. You two are way too noisy. You don't want to wake up silly Cobra now, do you? Sorry, the kids these days. Well, we've got no choice. We'll have to send you packing. It's all for the sake of silly Cobra. Dude. Uh. I know Game Freak didn't have a lot of time on this game, but the stuff Team Yell does is just so retarded. Like, I, at this point, you know they're not an evil team, right? But then, it's just like, 
there's so much worse things that they could be doing, but instead, they're sitting here making sure a freaking Pokemon doesn't wake up and then starts complaining when they start stomping and they think we're drunk. I just, mm. I think I'll leave this to you soon. Keep up the pace. Hop, are you? Oh no, hop. So bad. Silicobo might, might wake up after all that ruckus. And there's no point of us sticking around. Let's get out of here. We'll, we'll make these bothersome kids holler some other day. Since you and Cinderace were brilliant together. See, B really wiped the floor with me last time we battled. And don't get me wrong, I can take a loss. Battling means you got to lose sometimes. But he said that I was dragging these good names in the mud, being so rubbish like I was. Can we stop zooming into the back of his face? It's kind of like weird. And I just can't go get those words out of my head. Needs an ass. If I'm weak, then then people will think Lee's weak too. But I don't want that. I can't let Lee get dragged down. He's the unbeatable champion. I'm gonna have to take some time figuring this out. See you around soon. Hop, no. It finally woke up after Hop left. It's leaving now. Wow. You're one of the gym challenges lived by Leon, aren't you? Wait, who are you? My name's Opal. If you want to know more, have a look at my league card. I mean, alright. Thanks, I guess. I'll keep an eye on you, child. I want to see what you can do when you go all out. I mean, it's kind of cool that we get to meet somebody else important, but damn, she walks so slow. Like, gotta have to wait like an entire minute for her to get off screen, bro. Oh, freaking uh, heck. I'll see you guys when I get out of here. We finally made it to... I already forgot what this place is called. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Oh, jeez, man. I need to heal. Oh, hop there. Synth. I'm still not sure what to do. I should, what I should do all, about all the stuff I told you before. About me being weak and dragging down Lee's good name and all that, yeah? The only thing I can do is get stronger, right? So I'm gonna try out all kinds of different things against you to see what works. You're on. Let's do this. I put not out battle with my true rival to help me get my head straight. Why can I say I didn't expect this, but at the same time I did expect this? So that's another hot battle. He has four Pokemon now, and he has that. Why do you have that? All, all I have to take and I'm counting on you to help me grab it. No, is he talking to his Pokemon or me? Because I'm concerned. The reason I don't like that is because it can choke on a Pikachu and that kind of makes me sad. Pikachu is slowly dying. <coughs> I don't have much commentary for this battle. I mean, I, I want to keep it in though, but... Hop, I feel bad for Hop, but... Hop practically being shadowed by his brother no matter where he goes they always just bring up his brother they don't bring up like anything that hop can do i don't know what is charge sure i guess Ta -da. wacky it's his starter well, um, no lie, Hop. I'm trying to finish this battle pretty fast, so I'll just try going for some of the entire time.
Who would have named for a super effective hit if they had the chance, right? Uh, oh, up. I feel way too bad for you. Silicobra. I've seen that. I don't know what it's weak against, though. So let's just put out Annoying Dog. Doesn't even affect him. Wow, okay. So I guess I can't even use electric type on that. Let's just charge then, because it raises special defense if I'm correct. Yeah, so power. Special defense. Yep. Dig. And wow, that's super effective. Why am I bad? How's that? Super effective damage. I'm always looking for an opening. Wow, I did not expect that. Let's try Crunch. It didn't even... Okay, hop. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hop, why? Now I have to wait another turn. Hop out with the dig. For another crunch, epic games. I thought since battle's over, but you still have your woo woo, right? Does it really evolve? I don't even know what it evolves into, though. Toxel. Uh, let's have Cinder. Actually, you know, let's throw in Yukio. I named my snow run Yukio because. Yukio is Japanese for snow, I think. So, I don't know what, what I don't know what I can do to try to win. I oh that thing! I've seen that thing all over, not all over the internet, but I've seen it multiple times. Apparently, it evolved into something like super good. So maybe I'll try to catch one for myself. Ouch, I, even I hurt when you manage to land a critical hit like that. I'm pretty sure that attack always hits critical hits. I can't, I could just be stupid though, I don't remember. My strategy goes right to pot when I've got all these bad thoughts running through my head. Feels bad, man. You really do be like that sometimes. Whoa, Corv Corv Squire is evolving. Wow. Epic. Well, you helped out, Hop. I got a Corbin right now. Flying and Steel. That's an odd typing. Steel Wing. Um. Let's just forget Power Trip. Power Trip is ass. Stealing instead. <coughs> mm. Mm. I tried switching my team members in and out to max, their, to max out their potential in every matchup, but we just couldn't get together somehow. Maybe that's why I'm still so weak. Ali is really the greatest trainer. I don't want people to be laughing at him all because his little butt brother is rubbish. It's not enough. I've got to try harder and harder and harder. And harder till no one's laughing. I'm off, mate. Off to the kind of po off to find the kind of Pokemon that I can really draw the strength out of. All right, see you later, Hop. Oh Jesus Christ! Scared the f out of me. That child. Gym challenge should sure battle for the sake of their own Pokemon. Why are you worrying about saving the champ's name? We all know he's unbeatable. Well, that's his younger. That's his younger brother. So I guess he still has a point. Anyway, here's something for letting me watch your battle. I didn't even know you were there. B's League card. Oh, that's the... Now, you on you go, child. You're headed to the still onside gym next, no? Gym challenge is about having fun. Oh, 
Well, see you later, Opal. Please don't tell me we're watching her climb upstairs. Okay. And I think that's just about all the time we have in this video. Um. Yeah, next we're taking on B in the Stowan Side Stadium. So if we check. Not the bag, I'm an idiot. We check the lead cards. We got Opal. Alright. Oldest gym leader in the gallery. She took over for her mother 70 years ago and has kept the position since. However, she feels that her own values have reached her limits, and thus she is currently looking for a worthy successor. She claims that she gives deliberately tricky quizzes because people reveal their true colors when a pin. Many speculate that in reality she does it out of pure spite. <laughs> Bro, what the heck? And then we got B. Given special attention from her parents, B trained hard with her partner Pokemon since a very young age. As holding her judgment skills and able to remain calm and collected even when facing dire situations in the battle. This leads many to think she lacks emotion, but the truth seems to be that she doesn't want to show weakness. She sometimes no she is sometimes known to show her true feelings when her partner po to her partner Pokemon during battles. She is secretly a huge fan of various sweets, but this has been really f this this has recently been found out by her fans. This uh, the additional attention has made enjoying sweets a little difficult. <laughs> what the heck, dude? What? That's Epic Games, I guess. I don't even know. So yeah, that's the end of this video. If you all liked it, like, subscribe, and comment, and tell me what I should play. And uh, I'll see you all. Uh, see you all next time.